So what's up guys welcome back to another video and today we will talk about IMS counseling process. I have already a video on this topic for the last year 2020 batch. I have explained everything uh, in that video. You can get the link of that video in the description box or you can watch it by clicking on the iCard button. But uh, on huge demand I am making this video again uh, about the new counseling process. I will explain everything step by step so please watch the video carefully till the end. So before starting the video, I want to make few things clear about the IMUS counseling process, which is it is only for IMUS campuses. The counseling process is only for IMUS campuses. The list of IMU campuses you will get on the screen or I'll show you. These are the courses, uh, UG courses, and these are the IMUS campuses I am talking about. You'll get the chance of admission in these campuses only by this counseling process you will not get the chance of admission in any of the affiliated institute the second one is the courses offered by different campuses you will uh, you will see here uh, the different courses offered by different institute like uh, btech by chennai kolkata and mumbai port btech naval architect and ocean engineering in visakhapatnam bsc nautical science in chennai Kochi, Navi Mumbai and Diploma in Nautical Science in Chennai and Navi Mumbai. These are the UG courses and these are the IMU campuses. So talking about the third point which is very important, the placement record before getting in any of the IMU's campus, please check the placement record of that particular campus. Please visit Quora.com for more information regarding placement record. There are many students sharing their experience of placement and their life in IMU campus. Or you can watch my two videos, uh, thumbnail of that you will be uh, seeing on your screen. The first one is DNS in IMU campus. I have shared the uh, placement percentage of DNS in IMU campus. And the second one is BSc in IMU campus. So guys, now talking about the fourth point which is quite important also which is DNS without sponsorship. As we all know that DNS is a sponsored program, you must have a sponsorship in your hand before joining uh, DNS in any campus or any institute. But in IMU, it is conducted without sponsorship. You can have direct counseling and you have direct admission in DNS without sponsorship. IMU conducts DNS in its two institute, uh, two campuses, sorry, which is Chennai and Navi Mumbai. So before joining DNS program in IMU campus, please watch my video on this topic, DNS in IMU campus. I have a proper video on this topic sharing the placement record of DNS in IMU campus. A link of that video will get in description box or you can watch it by clicking on the iCard button. So guys now let's talk about the IMU's counseling process step by step. Uh, you will get the registration counseling registration link in the description below. You can visit directly or you can visit IMU's official website imu.edu.in and on the home page you will see the link IMU admission 2021-2022 rank list rank certificate download and counseling link and after clicking on this link you will get an interface like this and on the top you can see counseling registration link for admission to IMU courses 2021 so after clicking on this link you will get to a new web page which is like this uh, the interface will be like this where you have to log in with your credentials your user id your password and then you have to click on login button and after clicking on this login button you will get a dashboard which only belongs to you where you have to check your basic registration details then personal details then academic details then upload document on every page like on basic registration after checking all the details you have to click continue then personal details then academic details you have to verify all the information correctly if you want to get admission in IMU campus and after uh, on the last section or uh, the upload document section you will get a interface uh, sorry section like this where it is clearly written UG BSc nautical science DNS BTEC marine engineering candidates should meet the medical standards specified for these programs by DG shipping uh, you will get a link by click here uh, after on clicking this click here link you will uh, redirect it to a web page where you will come to know about the medical standards uh, required for this courses, uh, these three courses BSc Nautical Science, DNS and BTEC Marine Engineering. So you have to confirm here for few things like uh, if you are joining DNS and BSc Nautical Science you must have a 6x6 six six eyesight and if you are joining uh, if you are about to join BTEC Marine Engineering you must have an eyesight of uh, 
not uh, more than 6.9 so you have to uh, tick yes and then you have to click continue so after clicking on the continue button you will be redirected to the payment page where you can see your user id your name email id and the fee amount the fee amount is 10000 rupees you have to make payment for uh, to continue your counseling process there are many instruction before uh, making payment so please read it carefully for the payment information there are many information like do not refresh the payment page or do not click back on the payment page there are many instruction please read it carefully before making uh, your payment so what after the payment of 10000 rupees please read the fifth point carefully after successful payment you will be asked to upload the certificates again this is to ensure that you upload latest and properly scanned documents so after successful payment of 10000 rupees you will be uh, redirected to your dashboard again for upload of few important documents which will be i think your 10th or 12th mark sheet or you will get to know about these documents when you will be filling your counseling form so after successful uploading your certificate you will be redirected to your choice filling page talking about the choice filling page it is quite important stage because here you choose which course you want to do in which campus so like if you want to do btech marine engineering so you have three options a btech marine engineering in kolkata campus chennai campus mumbai port campus and if you want to do naval architect and ocean engineering you have only one uh, option which is imu visakhapatnam campus and if you want to pursue bsc nautical science then you have three options like navi mumbai campus chennai campus and kochi campus and if you want to pursue dns then you have two options imu navi mumbai campus and imu chennai campus so guys it is totally up to you which course in which campus you want to do so please select it carefully like if you want to pursue btech then you can choose btech in any of the campus in top of your uh, preference like if you want to do it from kolkata campus then you can choose it for uh, your preference on the top of the list then chennai campus then mumbai port campus according to your preference and if you want to do naval architect and ocean engineering then you can select btech naval architect and ocean engineering in imu visakhapatnam on the top of your list and same for the bsc nautical science and same for the diploma in nautical science so after filling your choices on choice filling web page you can click on confirm and log button and after clicking on this confirm and log button you will get a preview page where you have to click on confirm by uh, checking all the preferences and if you uh, if you are clicking on this confirm button you will get an otp on your registered mobile number and you have to put that otp on this on that page and your counseling registration process is completed so after successful completion of your registration process you can download or print that uh, web page where you have filled your choices and you can also download or print the payment receipt and after doing this you can log out from that process and if you have any doubt regarding counseling process further you can mail them at cet21 at the rate imu.ac.in so guys now let's talk about some important dates regarding this counseling process the first one is first round counseling registration is start date 23 9 2021 so the this registration counseling registration link was activated on 23 9 2021 and the last date of this registration is 27 9 2021 so you can register for counseling for the first round in these dates only so as we all know that the improvement candidates get will get their rank after their result so the second round of counseling will start after their result will be uh, displayed on the screen now talking about the third point which is publication of first list and opening of portal for online payment of program fee which is 39 2021 so on the last day of this month you will get the first list of counseling and uh, uh, those who have filled the counseling form please check your name in that list whether you have got your preferred institute and course so if you uh, if you will be satisfied with your course allot allotted course and campus please confirm it by paying a uh, paying a fee of 25000 rupees which will be further adjusted in your uh, program fee and those who were uh, those who will be not satisfied with their allotment of campus and course please do not confirm after the publication of first list on 39 2021 the last date for seat acceptance for first list candidates is 3 10 2021 before 3 10 2021 you have to confirm your seat if you want to take admission in imu campus if you will not confirm your seat by paying the program fee of 25000 then your seat will be allotted to someone else in the second list so after the confirmation of the seat you have to be very quick like you have to visit a doctor dgs approved doctor and you will have your medicals and after taking that medical certificate and gather all the certificate you have to physically present at that particular campus which, which you have selected 
for the certificate verification and the last date of certificate verification is 4 10 2021 so guys that's it for this video if you found this video informative you can like this video or if you have any doubt related to counseling process you can join our telegram group where we discuss about your doubts and also you can ask it in the comment section and please subscribe the channel for more informative video thank you for watching this video